of law and order in Shane Calvary. Uh, thank you, Mr. President and members of the board. Today we have a proposed findings of fact conclusions of law and order regarding uh, Arkansas Department of Health versus Shane Calloway doing business as Calloway Plumbing Contractors. Uh, we had a hearing last year on Mr. Calloway and our intrepid committee um, had recommendations of Dr. Fritchman and uh, uh, Mr. George Harper and Dr. Danica Whitfield. But uh, Mr. Calloway, and he was here earlier, uh, wants to appeal that and has perhaps additional evidence. So our recommendation is to uh, remand this back to actually uh, the individual sewage uh, disposal committee, the individual sewage disposal systems advisory committee. Uh, they have expertise in that area. Uh, and so for to hear possibly this additional evidence and, and, and consider the appeal of uh, Mr. Calloway. Uh, Mr. Calloway, I gave him permission uh, uh, kind of prematurely perhaps to leave, but uh, uh, that's okay with the committee. That's our recommendation. Reggie, you, you need us to vote to allow that to go back to the advisory committee? Uh, that's correct. Are so you, are you second. In, are you inferring that we're too dumb to understand this new? New <laughs> No, your wisdom exceeds my uh, words of expression. <laughs> I can't put I words to this, but I don't want to waste your back of time. So perhaps this other committee, uh, and, and then they could perhaps send it back to you, but we don't want to waste our time. Is, is, okay. this, is this the respect I've long wanted? <laughs> you can all respect your dude. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, <laughs> all right, so let's try it again. Who moves that we accept what's been proposed? By right. attention. Is there it. a second? second. Any further discussion? <laughs> all in favor say aye. 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 Are there any opposed? Very good. The uh, next item. Approval of reconsent request for the Arkansas Central Cancer Registry. Rick Hogan. Uh, Mr. President, members of the board, uh, thank you very much. This is uh, actually some very exciting public health research going on that we're asking approval for. Uh, I have Ms. Abby Holt here, which is our epidemiologist kind of leading uh, this particular uh, document uh, provision. The reason we're here today is because of Arkansas Code 20-15-203, which is at the back of your packet there, it requires that in order to access or divulge this uh, cancer registry uh, information, that we have to have the uh, approval from the State Board of Health. In your packet, you should have a, a document that looks like this. Uh, it starts out saying uh, active consent form, uh, there are actually five different requests, I think, Abby, is that correct? And I'll ask her to come on up and she can answer. The process we follow when we get requests like this is to ensure that the research itself is IRB approved or that it's approved in such an extent that it's protected, the information will be protected, of course. Uh, we go through our own science advisory committee and Dr. Bates would have been here He'll be here a little bit later. So he, he chairs that committee. They meet uh, a couple of times a month, and they look at research requests for data and information. Uh, I have reviewed it. This has also been reviewed by a subcommittee of the Arkansas State Board of Health, a subcommittee uh, made up of Dr. Bast, uh, Dr. Foster, and also Catherine Tapp. And our next agenda item and other business will also take up the standing committee on this. But I'll turn it over. If you have any questions about the specific data that we will be releasing pursuant to the, uh, the specific uh, data request for research, uh, Abby can address those. Thank you. Um, I think four of the requests that we are coming from the North American Association of Central Cancer Registries. So annually, we submit um, our data file to them, and they measure our data for completeness um, for reporting purposes. And so researchers can request that data um, for their own research. And 
NACER, the North American Association, they have their own IRB board where these are approved. Um, the data set that's submitted to NACER is a de-identified data set. So names are not included, social security numbers, none of that. It's mainly the tumor information and primary site histology and things like that. Any further questions? We'd ask for a motion. Uh, Dr. Foster was the chair of our subcommittee, and she heard this uh, information previously. So we'd ask her to make a motion if that's appropriate. Mr. President. And I make a motion that this be accepted as presented. Thank you. 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 Thank you.